people could never dream of carrying out any kind of demonstrations. It was outlawed, the demonstrations. But we demonstrated, and eventually, after very heavy price paid by the people of Kenya, we got a new constitution. That new constitution has been built as one of the best constitutions in the world in terms of human rights provisions section of that constitution. The constitution that guarantees the right to do what you want to do, the right to picket, the right to petition, the right to demonstrate. It's all enshrined in the constitution. If there is something that you don't like, you have a right to demonstrate. People are demonstrating all over the world. They're demonstrating in France. They're demonstrating in Israel. They're demonstrating in Australia. They've been demonstrating in Senegal. Yet in Kenya, somebody proposed to criminalize demonstrations. That is, demonstrators are going to destroy properties of other Kenyans. Demonstrations are going to destroy properties of other Kenyans. You ask yourself, what properties do you destroy in Nyalenda? What properties do you destroy in Kibera? What properties are you destroying in Madhari? Which properties are you destroying in Sondu? Which properties are you destroying in Migori? These are basically excuses to kill Kenyans in cold blood. And he must say no. Somebody goes and then prides himself, praises the policeman when he's talking to another part of the country, spewing political propaganda. That, oh, oh, into a kaliangumu. Into a kaliangumu. Yee, how do you know? What do you know? Kanyaga. Tumba Kanyaga. Because you've killed innocent people, you're, go you're going to shout at the top of your voice in another part of the country and, and you're purporting to be a leader of a country. Every life must, must count. And then you're obsessed with saying, oh, my, my next responsibility is to take Raila to Bondo. Raila knows how to get to Bondo. <laughs> I don't need Viru to take me to Bondo. But what is done is criminal. These people's hands are full of the blood of innocent Kenyans. Innocent Kenyans. And that is why we are all very emotional about this. And this is not something that should be allowed to pass away. We have said that Kenyans have a right. People have a reason to go to the streets. People are not mad to go to the streets merely because Raila said go to the streets. They are going there because of their good reason to do so. They are talking about high cost of living. They are talking about high taxation. They are talking about education for their children. They are talking about electoral justice. All these are very fundamental issues that Kenyans are raising against this regime. And therefore we have said that this regime must stand condemned in the strongest terms possible with all civilized man by mankind. We will not be cowed. And I've said that people don't have to come to the streets. There are many other different ways of protesting. We can ask the people to stay home and don't go out to the street to be shot by police. And next time, we're not going to ask people to go out and demonstrate. We'll tell them, Ka nyumbani. Ka nyumbani. And people will stay home. They will not go to work. Mr. Ruto does not own Kenya. It does not own Kenya. It does not own Kenya. And Mr. Ruto, Kenya does is not consist of only two tribes. Kenya consists of 46 tribes. Even those who did not vote vote for Kenya Kwanza are Kenyans and are taxpaying Kenyans, and they have a right to demand services from a government. So we will not allow you to play with the rights of innocent people. We will not allow you to trample the rights of our people. We will resist. We will resist and we will resist. 
We've agreed, yes, we can talk. But we'll only talk so long as there are conducive environment for talking. We have also said we do not want a share in Kenya Kwanza government. We do not want handshake, hands which are tainted with, with the innocent blood of our people. We will not touch those hands. We will not touch those hands. We will not touch those hands. We will stick to what is right for our people. Yuthurwa. Aloso manganya enya, gimerima, kijadwa na nisi ruto ni okonwa tuko kode. Ofuoka ngo. 